<laughs> that damn theme song is stuck in my head what's going on guys welcome back to the channel once again for another episode of black sales season 2 episode 4 i don't know how many episodes is in this season but i don't know if i'm halfway through with watching this episode or if it's the same eight episodes or is it going to be more i don't know i didn't check um but in any case we're going to go watch this episode because I want to know because it seems like we're going to have a little Flint versus Vane in this episode. All right. So we're going to jump into it, man. If you have not liked the video yet, what are you waiting on, man? Leave a like on the video. And of course, if you have not signed up for early access yet, please consider doing so. It's only two dollars a month. It's not hurt in your pocket. If it is. Let your boy know, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Let me send you $2 or, or more. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Because if, if we out here struggling with $2, or finding $2, you watching my videos, bruh, that's, 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 that's a problem. We need to work on that. So reach out. You know what I'm saying? Reach out. Anyways, thank you guys so much, man. I appreciate y'all. Let's go watch the episode. I will see you guys for the review. I really thought he was gonna back down there. I really did. <laughs> I thought, you know, Mr. Scott had to put some some sense into him, but no, it did not happen that way. <laughs> no. Flynn said he wants the smoke, literally. <laughs> but great episode again, once again, man. What can I say? There's, I mean, all these episodes right now are 10 out of 10. There's nothing out of place. There's no storylines that you're like, what is going on? Like, everything is connected. So I'm wondering if if Mrs. Barlow is going to get a message out on a way that, um, to Eleanor, that they could leverage this entire thing. So I, I don't know. But she remembers something. Mr. Peter Ash is going to come in with the save some way his name is going to save something and i don't know what it is and i'm not going to be reacting to black sales again until next week but in any case this was an awesome episode we got um i think i'm enjoying the backstory more than i'm enjoying the actual real-time story right now to be honest like the backstory on flint is more interesting just for me because I, I like to have prior knowledge of character you know with characters and their development is, is is like i love that i love to see that that's one of the reasons why i love watching arrow so much when it was airing you know when they used to do it in the earlier seasons when they used to show him being the green arrow and then they would do flashbacks of when he was on the island you know what i'm saying um so it, it, one of the things that I love, I love when shows do it. I love when TV shows do that. Um, I don't know why, but I just, I just like it because you get to see what they were going through while they were in that place. Or we, you know, the Flint that we're seeing in present day is not the same Flint of before, obviously. And you know, I was always intrigued to know how did he get with Miss Barlow. You know what I'm saying? Like we've heard the story, we heard the story of affairs. You know what I'm saying? But in some ways, I, for some reason, I just don't feel like, you know what I'm saying? This is, I don't know. I st I'm still not clear. I don't think he knows. I don't think he knows. I don't, I don't think he knows that this dude is like fooling around with his wife. But a conversation they had at the table with his, with his father, you know what I'm saying? Like, he was a big thinker. You know what I'm saying? You know, he was even telling him, it's like, why can't we forgive him? You know what I'm saying? For, for doing what they did. And a lot of times, you know what I mean? Like, don't get me wrong. Some things, you know, you could look at it and be like, no, that's unforgivable and stuff like that. Because they did have a choice and choosing. And I understand where his father is coming from, where everybody's coming from. But supposedly, if you give these men a chance to earn an honest wage... Of course, not all of them is going to go for it. I don't believe that. But I think the majority of them would go for it. Instead of living a life where, they, where they're constantly being chased by, by 
you know what I'm saying, looking over their shoulder to think, oh, this Spanish or this English soldier is going to kill him, whatever the situation is, you know, it, it, it's, it's a situation where you really do have to take into consideration of everything that's going on, and you have to make that decision, and I think the majority of them would take the best way out, earn an honest wage, you get pardoned for all the crimes you did, you know what I'm saying, and I'm not saying, you know, some people's gonna be like, no, hang them all, you know, um, you know, if, if given the chance to forgive, and it'll take that, and I'm, I'm saying, I'm just saying, people do deserve a second chance, you know what I'm saying, um, they do deserve that, I'm not saying I'm all in with, with everything he wants to do, <laughs> you know what I'm saying, he's a big pitcher, he's a big thinker guy, and I think it influenced Flint a lot, and the reason why he's doing the things that he does now, because he, he considered this dude to be such a good friend to him, and the, the things that he imagined is what he's trying to accomplish now, you know what I'm saying, and this is Barlow, or Hamilton, whatever you want to call her, she's been, she wants to run away from all of that, you know what I mean, like, um, she said it herself, it's like, you know, men like you guys, it's like once you're getting into your head for, for a certain thing, you just don't want to let go of it, you know, um, so that resonated a lot with his character now, because it's like, uh, is he really doing this for her? Or he's doing this for his old friend. I don't know how he died. But I think that conversation. That happened around the table. With his father. Is what kind of turned everything upside down. Um, for them later on. And I'm hopefully that they show everything that happened. To catch us up to speed. As to what caused the discord. And why was he killed. Like. You know what I'm saying. Like why was he killed. Um. There's a lot to learn about Flynn's past, and I'm glad that you're doing that this season. Really do appreciate that. Um, another thing, another thing. Yes, uh, the the attack on the fourth that is about to happen. You know, after sound reasoning, he still decides to go ahead with it. Uh, so there's that. We also have a situation going on with you know Max and and Jack. He finally got a ship finally got a crew he's going to be a captain so i don't know if i don't think max is going to go with him he's probably going to leave max in charge off the off the you know the whorehouse or whatever um so we'll see how that goes but in any case that is that is that is how it is that is how it is you know um i remember one time that ah uh, man why am i remembering that at, <laughs> at a time like this uh, but any case, I'm not going to tell you guys what just went on in my mind. But in any case, guys, thank you guys so much for tuning in. We're getting warmed up. I still didn't check how many episodes is in the season. I don't know. But um, hopefully we are halfway through. I mean, same eight episodes or maybe it's ten this season. I don't know. But in any case, thank you guys so much for tuning in. I want to see what happens in the next episode, unfortunately for me. Um, I'm not going to be able to see that until next week week what happens next but it is what it is i have other series i need to react to today just chomped out four episodes it's gonna be two episodes on early reaction um and uh and two is gonna come out on friday and saturday for y'all so loving it anyways it's your, it's your boy up you know i'm saying hit that like button comment on the video man i'm out peace